Hi, I'm Yaakov Hotter from gypsyandjazz.com and today I'm going to show you how I hold the pick. It's a question that I'm getting all the time from guitarists who don't know how to hold the pick. So first, a short story about me. I used to pick with a lot of different ways. I used to hold the pick like Pat Metini and play like that and then like uh, uh, um, West Montgomery I just play with my thumb and then I got into a John McLaughlin period and I really adapt his way of um, his technique and how he holds the pick and of course when I played rock and blues you need you know to lean here and to play the the alternate picking so I tried it all and I never felt like this is exactly my thing until I got to the rest stroke picking is the picking of uh, the gypsy jazz uh, technique the the way that gypsy guitarists who play jazz uh, pick and I also found their pick which is usually uh, very big and um, and thick and um, and when I learned this technique, it really changed the way I play. I really love the sound. It's the same technique that I play when I play oud. It's a technique that helps you get the, the maximum sound of your guitar. So, I think that you can implement the way I hold the pick to any other uh, picking method. But uh, in the gypsy jazz picking, we play with a floating hand. It means that my hand is not... I don't touch the guitar body when I play, right? I'm not leaning on the guitar or here. I'm floating and I'm, I'm letting the, the strings ring. Now, the pick that I use was built by Wagen. As you can see, my pick has lines on it from both, si both sides. And you see it's like 45 degrees from the top of the pick. And if you follow these lines, and you can imagine them on your pick and you follow these lines with your index and thumb in uh, each side of the pick you will get the following shape here my uh, thumb goes to one direction my index finger go to the second direction and the pick is in the middle and when I hit the strings you see that the pick hit the string and the nail of my index finger can hit the string a little bit as well, touch the string. So you can see the shape. My uh, index fingers go to one direction. My thumb goes to the next the, the different direction. And the pick is in the middle. And you get that shape. Now I hope it helped you to understand how to hold the pick. Don't hold it too tight without force because you want the pick to be uh, flexible on your string, not going into the string, but to have flexibility there. All right, and you see the shape that I talked about. You have one finger, you have the thumb, and the pick is in the middle. And my hand is a little bit, you know, slightly bent, so there is freedom and that's how I hold the pick. I hope you enjoyed it. Write me your comment below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you won't miss any of my other uh, lessons. Cheers.